Attentive, <laughs> boisterous, <laughs> ambitious, compassionate, unrelenting, and sincere. That's my son. Six adjectives <laughs> which describe me. But also, <laughs> six adjectives whose first letters spell out abacus. <laughs> which is like a match made in heaven. Yeah. It is through my attentiveness which will allow me to spot even the tiniest of mistakes. And my boisterous, the boisterousness which will be the spirit of every event, no matter where and when. My ambition will catalyze me to reach new heights with the society, regardless of the last mountain we've climbed together. But it is through compassion that will work through the lowest of lows. Shout out to the Student Center Coalition. And unrelentingly, we'll attempt together the most grueling of times. But ultimately, sincerely, and wholeheartedly, with me, Edgar, as Vice President, and you as my passenger, Abacus will become what you and I want it to be. Thank you. <laughs> Abacus stands for the um, <laughs> Association of British and Chinese University Students. Okay, so um, there have been times where committee members have to leave the school due to certain circumstances. Um, and if you were the vice president, not president, what would you do? Um, would you step in and take the main responsibilities, or would you find a new president? And um, if this was another member of the committee, like a GenSec or a Vance, what would you do? Yeah, so firstly, um, if it was the president who left, um, in the short term, we definitely have to look at what's happening right now. So are there any events that I'll have to take over and organize? So I'll try and do that, uh, sort it out first. And then in the long term, if the president is gonna be gone for a, like, maybe they dropped out, <laughs> well, look, firstly, I'll have a talk with the team, right, and we'll see uh, if I can take up the responsibilities of the president or if anyone else wants to, and then we'll probably put it up to a vote, so who's the next president. Uh, and if this was another member of the committee, such as the GenSec, we'd probably put the position up for nomination again. Uh, we can have by-elections, right, and we can nominate a new one. but. Honestly, I think it really depends on why they're gone and whether they'll even come back. Because if they'll come back in a week, like, you know, we can have them be. But if they're not coming back ever, then we'll have to be there. Um, Okay, so um, there when working with the other vice presidents during the inter-uni events, like the dinners, there have been times where there's conflict between different schools, and if like UCL was caught in the middle of this argument, what would you do and why? And would you step in as a mediator, or would you like not be part of it? Yeah, so the first thing we want to do uh, if we have conflict with other unis is to sort out our internal conflicts. So we can do this by having an in-person meeting, and then talking it out, and then at the end of the meeting, making sure we have, like, we stick to our agenda, and then we come out with all the solutions and all the points we've agreed to. And then in that case, then we can uh, work with the other unis, and we can say UCL has this idea, and this is what we think should happen, and we'll see what the other unis say. In terms of being the mediator or staying out of it, I think as one of the biggest unis, we sort of have a poll and we should be the mediator, but we should also have our opinion, which we push onto them. <laughs> Going back to scenario question one, and say like it's in the scenario where you need to vote for a new president. Um, suddenly, a white guy wants to run for a president. How would you um, would you be okay with it, or how would you? Is he British? He it is. Do you know the association of British and Chinese students? It's, that's, that's it's all about inclusivity. But he has to win the vote. <laughs> right? If it's a democratic situation, he's going to pull the votes. If he pulls the votes, then he deserves it. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah.
Any other questions? Okay, thank you.